Hello there, Model Engineers. Right, I thought I'd take a few minutes to make a, another video showing this uh, little Stuart number no. 4 replica engine I've been making. Um, it's mainly for the benefit of the um, guys and gals on Model Engine Makers Forum, but uh, for anybody else that hasn't seen it, it's, uh, it's part um, bar sock made and part castings. The cylinder is a casting. The trunk guide was something I bought from a, a, a local um, junkyard sale, and the, the rest I've uh, fabricated just, you know, roughly to, to keep in line with the Stuart design. It, it's slightly modified, um, but it's uh, I thought it's sort of turned out quite well. There's still a few uh, bits to do yet, um, and it's only loosely pinned together. As you can see, there's only two bolts all in the cylinder top on the, there isn't any gaskets or packing or anything in it but it, it, it's in a position now where it does actually run so I thought I'll take a, a minute or two and uh, fire it up on the, on the cold stuff some compressed air um, that needs to come out it, it was originally a casting for steward number no. 9 which is a horizontal engine so, so hence the S is is cockeyed but that's the least of all these. The eccentric rod, valve rod, uh, I'm going to titivate that up a little bit, maybe put a bit of a taper in it and it's got them shortened and rounded at the top. It needs a few oil cups making and a little oil cup there perhaps. So there is a fair bit to do yet um, and I, I want the mounted on this base with a outrigger bearing and a, a little pulley to drive something, possibly a pump, but I'll see how it, uh, see how it performs once I can get it piped up and running on steam. But for now, what I'm going to do is, um, I've got this little airbrush compressor, it's, um, it's not a very good thing and it makes a hell of a racket, so you won't be able to hear me talk when it's running, but I'll give it a little fire up and you, you can see how it performs. So here we go. I don't know whether you can hear me talking over the noise of the compressor, but it, it seems to be running reasonably smoothly, I thought. There doesn't seem to be any binding. Let's uh, turn it up a little bit. So there you go, it's a runner. Um, I'll titivate the, the base up and get some plumbing done and painted and whatever and uh, once it's all up and running finished um, I'll probably make another video and hopefully have it running on steam. So anyway thanks uh, for, for the help from everybody on the Model Engine Makers Forum, that was greatly appreciated. Okay, thank you, bye.